Hey and welcome to another episode of Finding Joe. We are down here at New Haven Boat Ramp. So come with us and we'll show you why. BCF for your birthday and just sort of cashed up and well yeah it's good we need that some more we've got a plethora of fish coming our way today as you can see behind us we've got the Cape Mullamai the end of Port Port Phillip no, no. Phillip Island idiot <laughs> moron absolutely foolish <laughs> Phillip Island there <clears throat> Cape Mullamai yep and we're going to use that as a blanket well, where'd you get this from blanket the wind to? Well, when you put a blanket over something, you're covered. Shelter. Shelter. So that's yeah, basically what shelter. we're doing here. Shelter. We are using the land shelter. as shelter. While it's calm, we'll just uh, set up morning tea. You're all swelly? You're all faithful. You're all mate. Old faithful. Old faithful. Old faithful. Old faithful. Old faithful. Nice. He got himself off. That is so shit. Yeah, but well that's probably the only byproduct. Trying to catch gummies and yeah. When I was doing my research, a lot of people did say that you get a fair whack of um, swell sharks, banjos and stuff at the entrance, at the eastern entrance. But we're foregoing that and just going to give it a crack and see if we can get some sort of gummy shark coming through. It'd be great. Nice Prove them wrong. Some nasty teeth. Nice sinking in the salty finger. Is it barracuda or pike? Either way, he's going to make some nice bait, yeah. I think. Very good bait, Charlie. Oh, pikeroony. Pikeroon! Oh, yeah, 300 grams. Nice. What have we got here, mate? Another one of your mates? Yeah, the problem, mate. The old swell shark. Yeah. <laughs> Two for one! Be nice if they could get him. What are they fighting over it? Look at them. Nah. Back the drag. Serious head knocks. Could be a ripper, fucking snapper. Get this out of your way, or you're right. Fuck. Lost it. Bugger. Whatever that was, that was a cracking fish. Yeah, dropped him. Hook properly? Yeah, it's obviously not, not corner hook properly. No, well, but right. I would say down, eh? by that it's either good gummy or very good snapper. Just so the people that know at home. Problem is fishing with ultralight gear, yeah it's good fun, but it's difficult to set the hook. That's what happened the last one, didn't it? Yeah. That's just right. didn't quite set that hook. But I couldn't up the drag to pull hard because I didn't want to pull the hook. It's okay, catch 22. But Makes it a little harder. We're almost there, you know. Ah, well, that's not going to work, is it? Fucking it's an epic fail no on your behalf, drag, mate. No fucking drag, mate. <laughs> Sitting there with no fucking drag on. They just don't like to fight at all, do they? Nah, they're rubbish. In fact, I brought up one of these blokes one time on a sinker. Not a hook. A sinker. Yeah. Tough life. Tough life? <laughs> Go, get ourselves. Get already. Cuttlefish. Yeah, big cuttlefish. Huge. Yeah, it's fucking huge, right? 
We brought him up, but we actually thought that was a swell shark. It's fucking big animal. Fucking it's pissed on me. Uh, yeah, still pissed still on pissing on me, you prick. It's <laughs> full of water. Another more one. Another more one. There's nothing wrong with that. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, half decent gummy. <laughs> Perfect timing. Well, you're not getting that one. You're going to take the call or what? No. You want the other rod out? Yeah. I'm not convinced I'm not hooked on the bottom. Man. Ah. You're looking on the bottom? I don't know. Stop it, will you? Cape Willamai had served its purpose. We'd used its shelter from the winds to our advantage. Sheltered in the calm conditions, we'd managed to catch a variety of fish. We'd also lost what we thought was a decent snapper or gummy. Swell and wind offshore still too rough, we moved into Western Port Bay behind New Haven. Found ourselves a drop off and waited. fish that are a couple of k's that way just been breezing down the channel like this swimming 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 and then gone This is where we walked in this morning. Completely underwater now. It's like, just be careful, there's that duty there. Not sure how light that's going to be, but what an incredible end to a great afternoon on the water. Just. 4.35 o'clock, we ended up hooking onto a massive, massive Melbourne skate, or broad nose skate as I call them. We tried to weigh it, but we just didn't have anything big enough to weigh it, so we're tipping, oh, good 60 to 80 kilos, I reckon. I 
think that's the addiction of fishing. You can sit out on the water all day. You can fight the rough. You can sit there when it's windy and it's raining. And all of a sudden at the end of the day, when you're just about to come in, you hook up onto a monster ray like that. What a treat that was. That was amazing. I uh, hope you enjoyed the footage. And we will see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe.